CTE to rule them all says, should I CTE or not CTE? Help me be kind to myself and others. Do you gain performance under the hood using them? T-SQL is a declarative language where you're declaring the shape of your result sets. You're not declaring the shape of the execution plan. Although you can, there are hints that you can put in that will govern how SQL Server does the plan. But generally speaking, CTEs, subqueries, there's all kinds of things that you can do with T-SQL that just explain to SQL Server what's the data that you want. If you get to the point, and so what I would tell you is write your queries in a way that are easy to understand first. The easier that they are for a human being to understand, the better off you're going to be with the query optimizer. When you get to the point where you're hitting performance walls and you need to rewrite to fix things, then check out one of two resources. Either check out my Mastering Server Tuning class or Itzik Ben-Gan's book, uh, T-SQL Querying. So either my Mastering Server Tuning class or Itzik Ben-Gan's book on T-SQL Querying, and both of those can teach you how to rewrite T-SQL, depending on which one of those learning methods that you prefer, will teach you how to rewrite existing T-SQL in a more performant way. I wish that I could tell you, always use this tool or never use this tool. But that wouldn't make sense, right? It's not like if you're a carpenter, you go, well, always use the hammer. Never use a screwdriver or a saw. That just doesn't make sense. We have to use different tools to accomplish different goals depending on what we're trying to do. And by asking, should I use a hammer, you're really exposing that maybe it's time for you to report to class or grab a book.